roof over your head, somewhere you can cook. It's a sense of belonging, that's where you go, it's your home, it's your palace. It makes me feel safe. My home is where I go to, to see my family. Wash, eat, sleep. And knowing that I've got a place to go um, at the end of the day. Somewhere to enjoy spending time with friends. Home to me is where my heart is and where the family are. The most important thing in my life. My home makes me feel happy. It's where I live with my mummy, daddy, my baby brother Tommy and cat Toby. Toby likes to sleep on my bed every night. One day my dad got very poorly and he couldn't go to work anymore. Mummy and Daddy couldn't pay any money for our house. Some people tried to make us leave our house, which was really scary. Daddy's car was even taken away. Mummy was very sad and I saw her crying. Mummy was angry with Daddy, even though it wasn't his fault. They shouted at each other a lot. Tommy started crying because he was frightened. Sometimes it was difficult to do my homework. My teacher sent a letter to Mummy because I wasn't doing well in my tests. Mummy and Daddy used to help me with my homework, but I think they're too busy now. At school, the other children made fun of me because I couldn't go on trips or didn't have the things they had. I heard Mummy saying she felt all alone, even though we were still with her, and Daddy stopped telling his silly jokes. I had to pack up my toys into boxes just in case we had to move out of our house, which made me very sad. Then our house became cold and we couldn't even turn our lights on. It didn't feel like my home anymore. Then one day Mummy spoke to a nice lady from the shelter place called Penny. Mummy and Daddy worked together with Penny to stop our house being taken away. She also helped Mummy get some help for Daddy. Penny really, really helped us. I was able to play with my teddies again. Daddy is getting better and he says he'll soon go back to work again soon. I still get frightened that people might make us leave our house, but I know we can call Penny for help now, so it's not so scary. Penny says that her job is not done until everyone has a home. Families like Emily's need your help. In Britain, thousands of people wake up every day in fear of losing their home or worse. Bad housing and fear of losing your home rob you of your security, health and a fair chance in life. Shelter helps people to find homes and keep them. We get to the root causes of the problem and work with individuals and families to help them find solutions and live without the fear of losing their home. We won't stop until there's a home for everyone.